apparently no jumper host Brick Baby and Nipsey Hustle Brothers Black Sam got into a little situation at Complex Con earlier today. Um, here's what Sharp had to say about the situation. Uh, I guess Sharp was with Brick Baby at the time and kind of gives his perspective of what happened. And, um, yeah. I'll give it to Brick, though. Brick ain't no other. Oh, they no, be, no. They be trying that nigga 10, 15 deep. He never turned it down. Yeah, no, yeah. We know that. That I give him for sure. So he's giving his props to Brick Baby, who was, um, sounds like he was outnumbered in the situation. And he still maintained his integrity. So, um, yeah, Sharp saying, look, uh, I have to give it to him. As y'all can see, we're going to look at the footage in a little second. But, yeah, he's giving him his props for standing 10. Nah, they be times. trying that nigga. I be noticing they that, too. They be trying him. They don't never try him. Like niggas, be po- niggas be poking the bear type shit. Like. Yeah, like, I, I noticed that, man. I mm-hmm. swear to God, it's, it's crazy. You know, I stay out the politics, though. I'm not a gang member. Plus, I'm not from L.A., so I don't be trying to fuck am I going to say. You know what I'm saying? I was told anything happened, Sharp, just step to the side, gang. Now, um, interestingly, he didn't kind of divulge because he doesn't. Uh, I guess it's not my place to speak either, but he didn't. He didn't put out why they. It even got to that point. Um, we don't know what the discrepancy is between Black Sam, but from what I understand, from the outside looking in. Black Sam seems like a non-confrontational person and seems like someone who is very down to earth and laid back and just not with like the aggressive behavior. So it must be something that um, has been festering for a while and just kind of building up because his character doesn't strike me as someone who kind of boils up and whatnot. Or it could have just been surrounding people and whatnot. But I was complex, Kondo. That shit was cool. <clears throat> it was cool. Ran, uh, talked to Barry a little bit. Talked to a few niggas around there. They like that too. They bring up certain situations. You find that shit be on the smallest page. Niggas wouldn't even think of. Exactly. Like, where the fuck this shit? They only got. They, they only got five hundred uh, followers and shit like that. Mm. Man, shout out to Rockstar and uh, Rockstar twenty eight hundred in his clubhouse room. Make sure y'all go check out his content. Make sure y'all go check him out. Um always providing dope content always providing dope dialogue and uh direct to consumer man so i i I appreciate it you know i i rock with his content and he does frequent um the state of arizona my stomping grounds so shout out to him but let's look at some of the footage that was taken there boom But from what I can see from the mouse arrow here, I guess this side would be Brick Baby. But you can only catch it in glimpses here. As you can see there, right? And then it looks like this like bigger group here seems to be Black Sam. But um, Brick Baby's very open about the situations that he goes through. So I'm eager to see him kind of break this situation down. Um, or it might just, well, from what I understand, Brick Baby is an official member of the neighborhood um, situation or gang, right? I don't like calling things gang because Rico's and all that stuff. But the, the neighborhood community, right? So... Um, I wonder if or what the ramifications are about speaking on this situation. I mean, Sharp told us from his perspective, um, it looks like Brick Baby was in a situation where they were trying to take his temper, temper, temperature and he wasn't going for it. So, yeah, uh, what do y'all think it was? I, I genuinely wonder what it was being that... Um, Um, Black Sam is a very intellectual person, from what I understand, from the research I've done, and the um, the part he's played in Nipsey Hussle's overall success. Sounds like he is someone who is very down to earth, is a thinker, intellectual, and whatnot. So for him to 
allow this to happen or for him to be around it or, or be attached to something like this must mean that um, there's some kind of emotional ties in this situation because uh, intellectual people often don't um, include emotions in their decisions and that's what makes them intellectual right so uh, I'm, I'm interested to see but one thing I do have to point out and I really really like is the fact that Sharp said that they're cool now and that they're good so that's a great thing because um black men hurting or harming another black man or just uh, especially black men or just people harming one another when there's conversations that could be had to just change the whole direction uh i, I love it i gotta champion that right because like i said uh, I'm, I'm a huge 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 advocate of conversations because conversation is literally the ground for for um for change right so but yeah man what do y'all think happened